Greetings, Federation. Well, that was not the game. The final score may not show it, but that was ugly. Most off, I'm going to have to get some help, mate. Just because it's pretty much going to be the big elephant in the room. I really hope Mahomes is okay. I mean, after that hit he took, the way he was treating his throwing arm and his shoulder in particular was kind of troublesome. I mean, so Shimmer came in and did a fantastic job to close out the game, but still, losing Mahomes would be not that not good for us, be kind of devastating. <laughs> but from what Cliff Kingfoy has said to the school radio, it doesn't appear to be too serious. So, fingers crossed. And if he is injured, hopefully it's not for too long. Okay. Now that that's out of the way. Oh boy, what a begin. First off, even though we are playing Kansas and Kansas is not the all-time greatest team, especially in offense, our defense did a adequate job. They they did. I mean, they held them to 19 points. They didn't allow that many big plays to happen. And they really say the ass when our offense was struggling. Now, I say they did an adequate job. Because they were still not tackling all that well, and they were still getting a lot of players who should not get open, wide open. The only reason Kansas couldn't connect is because they don't have a good quarterback. That's just a fact. If we're playing a, any other team in the Big 12 and any of those receivers got that wide open, they will pick us apart. So, our defense did good, but it's Kansas, and there's still a lot of flaws. But, there's something we can really build upon. Hopefully. <laughs> I keep saying that, but... Yeah. Special teams. Oh, they were special, alright, tonight? Yeah. Let's see. There was the... Mumph... Fail catch by, um... Bash. And... I don't know how that happened. I mean, it went just right through his arms. It felt as though we won't really focused on Candace. It felt like we were kind of sloppy, kind of going in the haze. How that happened, I don't know. And then that snap that was ordered in the safety, again, what the hell? I mean, and a bit before that, there was another bad snap that almost... Screwed us over big time, but Mahomes managed to save it, so. Our center was not having, well, the best day. And offense as entire unit? Well, they really won't be all that effective. Especially offensive line, which was getting dominated by Kansas' defense. And Kansas' defense really showed the play. They're the reason why it was a game for as long as it was. Well, they were just constantly disrupting us and getting to the backfield. Not to mention the amount of times our players false started. Yeah. Penalties were way way too high in this game. I think we got about 11 or 12 total penalties in this game, which is more than I would like to see ever in a game. I mean, we didn't break 100 yards, but 11 penalties is still 11 fucking penalties. And that was getting kind of, well, eye-rolling. There's a big play we did and call back because there was I think it was it the penalty called. It's turn my tongue. A legal man downfield. This one here. But you know what? What? 
That's how it matters. You won. Granted, Mahomes is questionable to return for the time being. And that's not something to really look forward to. But Shemanek did show himself to be a really great quarterback in situation. Now, granted, Kansas was kind of tired on defense at this point, so it's really hard to judge how effective he really is, but he did have poise, and he did have strong command in the offense, which is important, because if Mahomes is sitting out the next game, or a few games, to have him against Kansas State and West Virginia, that's going to be really helpful for us. That's going to be a big benefit in our favor. Well, those teams are not bad, but then again, they have a tendency to really be well coached. Uh, sorry, I'm a bit tired right now. So I'm probably just going to cut this off here. Otherwise, I say my few thoughts, which is offense, a bit shaky, came back. And perform well near the end. Now, hopefully, this is just the jittles after being well on a bye week. But it's just getting kind of funny how Candace can do this to us on a regular basis now. Kind of make it a game for as long as it. Tile game or a few quarters. Which is kind of why I have a small respect for them. Yeah. But anyway, until next week, Radio Nation. Guns up, Radio Powell, and Beckham Tech.